everything but I did which was really good and I had a lot of fun and once I let go it was really it was amazing. Awesome. Wait, what were we talking about? First? We're talking about the runway experience. Oh, I completely I'm so excited. In my runway experience I felt like it, I was really really confident for it and I was really really excited. I was practicing like all the afternoon for him. That's good, love well, practice. I really enjoy doing the runway and walking down with so much confidence and when all the lights are working, I just felt so amazing and strong and just beautiful. So it was a great experience. I love that. We actually have a clip for you of the runway experience with, I didn't see anybody falling, so <laughs> watch this. This is Division 3, uh, DJ, hit it. 
just be you. Honestly, they don't want to see you pretending to be somebody else. They want to see you. They want to see you in your walk. They want to see you in your TV commercial. They want to see you. So if you're putting your personality into everything that you do, you're definitely going to succeed. Any tips? Um, smile, definitely. But don't like over smile, because that just gives it a little bit of a fake effect. Right? Yeah, yeah. More natural smile. Yeah. I would have to say put your personality into it. Always be confident in what you're doing and what you want to show everybody. Wow, that, thank you guys. I love that. Uh, so don't go anywhere. We'll be right back to talk more about the Barbizon competition. <laughs> Are you an agent or manager 
struggling to find fresh, new faces? Try contestant number 520. <laughs> Brains, beauty, and talent. Three and one. And the best part is, you're already right where you need to be. <laughs> 521. Do you struggle with acne? Well, did you know 85% of people have experienced some point of acne? All my life, it's been an up and down battle until I found Pensacola Dermatology. <laughs> Five twenty-two. Times are tough, but affording the essentials shouldn't be. That's why I shop at Public. Budget-friendly meals for you and your family for only fifteen dollars. Public, where shopping is a pleasure. You've made a mess and you're still using the Ordinary Lean brand, try Lago Brands Paper Towels, the most absorbent paper towel brand out there. Lagos, where you clean up the mess you didn't need to leave. 524. When you're in the mood for something tangy or spicy, try Heinz 57. It's ketchup with the kick. Heinz 57, put a little spice in your life. Contestant 525, ever since I was little, I've been begging my parents for a phone. Then finally on my 12th birthday, they gifted me with the Samsung Galaxy A6. I love this phone so much because not only is it sturdy and reliable, but it also holds 400 gigabytes of storage. And the camera, please, don't even get me started. There are two megapixel cameras, both with LED flashes on each side. This phone is available at any AT&T store. So what are you waiting for? Go and get your new best friend. Contestant 526. Whenever I feel like a sweaty slob, there is always one solution to my problem. Deodorant. Just two swipes under the arm and you can go for days. Heck, you don't even have to take a shower for a whole week, even though that's nasty. But still, that's the good thing a part of it. Deodorant. Contestant 527. Only embassy hotels only embassy hotels gives you uh, only embassy hotels gives you two big rooms, a fresh cook to order breakfast, and evening beverages on the house. Because only embassy is because only embassy is twice the hotel. Call one eight hundred embassy. Testing 528. Are we all tired of wearing, no. Are we all tired of waking up we're trying to find something where? Well, I got the great solution for you. The dressinator, the five and two go. You can wear something funky or casual, whatever you desire. Don't wear nothing weird now. Contestant 529. When you use canvas, it makes your hair look so good that everybody wants to have a good day. It gives your hair that irresistible glow and shine. Canvas amplifying conditioner, the look that makes people's eyes glued to you. <laughs> that, that was actually so much fun. They're, again, they're funnier the second time around. So, we actually need to go to a break, so we'll be back. <laughs>
Scott. I'm Denise Annette. I'm Karen Wyatt. I'm Chris Richard. And we are still on Team C, in case you're wondering. <laughs> um, but we are still talking about the Barbizon competition. Um, what do you feel is the best thing you learned from the competition? For me personally, I learned to just go all out. For me, I really hold myself back because I'm so used to people saying like tone it down or it reads too big, so like just calm down a little bit. But when I did that TV commercial, I went all out and I was so happy and proud of what I did. And it really paid off. Yeah. I feel like I was pretty nervous, but I was able to actually get over that. Once I was able to get over that fact, I feel like I was actually I really learned leadership skills and I feel like the communication was the biggest part. Learn how to actually not be nervous in a really big crowd of people and my confidence definitely boosted sky high. I love that not everybody is actually able to just not be nervous in front of people. <laughs> what was your favorite like learning point or takeaway from what was on? Definitely being able to like send emails and be more polite when I'm around people and learning how to hold myself in a crowd and public speaking was definitely that's good. How about you? <laughs> uh, being myself and like never hiding that. Because when the agents and managers came, or just in general, they are looking for like a real person. Someone that's just themselves. Yeah, they're looking for you because there's only one you. Everyone can play someone else, but they need you to be yourself. And honestly, you need to be very courteous and respectful, which I can uh, attest that Barbizon is definitely taught you guys that because you're very courteous now. Um, don't go anywhere, we'll be right back. Who's gonna get up on this runway and strap yourself? I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. You can take it. Jose, I'm looking at you. Judges, please scratch contestant 531. This is 532. Are you an art lover? Check out Uni Tunes on Instagram. It's a black owned business run by a teenage entrepreneur. Their expertise are The Simpsons, Powerpuff Girls, Rick and Morty, and everything you can find on Cartoon Network. So, what are you doing? Go check them out now. On hot summer days, everyone needs something, anything that's cold. 
My personal favorite is Rita's Italian Ice. There is a wide range of flavors in ice and custards. So find your closest Rita store now and cool down. 534. Did you know that your home is a bigger polluter than your car? Talk to your local utility company today to get your free energy audit to reduce your utility bill and combat climate change. Hi, I'm contestant 535. It's time to recognize what's really important. Feeling good inside and out. That's where three glasses of low-fat or fat-free milk a day comes in. It's naturally nutrient-rich like no other beverage. It's nature's wellness drink. Discover it for yourself. Got milk? 536. They say you can never walk a mile in someone else's shoes. So, before you try, be yourself. Walk your own shoes. Converse. Custom. Create your own walk your own path. All right, judges, we are scratching contestant 537, but we are adding contestant 538, initials T, W. This is 538. My love for fabrics is out of this world, honey, but I can't sew. But it's okay, because that's why it's Velcro. Simple fabrics is the best. All right, I love the TV commercial division. Let's have a huge round of applause for them. <laughs> oh my God. Wasn't it a great show? <laughs> we all had fun. Uh, again, I'm Brittany Rock. I'm Mia Scott. I'm Denise Neff. I'm Karen Wyatt. I'm Chris Sharma. And that was our show for tonight. Hope to, hope to see you next time. Bye. Bye.